Good morning, Gail. Don't call me Gramtastic. Call me Grand Dama. <laughs> Gram Dama. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah. So this is the new Delaney. I always thought this was just for me. <laughs> it was. It should be the Gail Dama. Yeah. Uh, so this is a new Delaney um, that you're going to take me on a tour of. Yeah, an old one that they revised a little bit. Okay. It's a 6620, and it used to be the 6600. Okay, so they yeah. did a couple upgrades. Yeah, they um, uh, they supposedly made the grinder a little bit quieter, and we'll, okay. we'll see. And the drip tray is a little bit different, too. You can put a tall cup under here. It's got a little, it's got a little secret door. Nice. So. so why don't you just take me through all the features of the, of the machine here. Yeah, this is a... This is a one-touch machine, which means okay. that you can put this milk container in here, and you can program it for uh, latte, macchiato, and cappuccino. Okay. <laughs> right? And then you can also do just your basic drinks. Uh, espresso, long go, that kind of stuff. Short, uh, double espresso, and then a longer coffee, and then a double long coffee. Okay. So we can get into the programming, and you can see here. You can put the clock to come on. Uh, you set the clock. And then you can have this come on at a specific time, go off at a specific time, and then it has a, a condo mode, like a sleep mode as well. Nice. Okay, let me get and see, start at what time? Auto start? No, we don't have it on right now, but we could have it on to come on at 7.30 in the morning just for you, Kat. Okay. Descaling is not on. It will prompt you to descale. Temperature, you can change the temperature. Let's get in there low. Medium, high. And that's just across that's all coffee. Yep, exactly. Okay. okay. Off after three hours, you can change that as well. Water hardness, it gives you a test strip in the manual, which I don't have right here, but they give mm -hmm. you a test strip and you set the water hardness, and that tells the machine how often it should prompt you to descale. Okay. Because if you got hot water, they're going to have you do it more often. Got it. Uh -huh. All right. And it does come with descaling in the box, so... A solution. Yep. Okay. And uh, let's see. Take it back to factory. You can take it back to factory. You can turn the beep on or off. And the energy saving mode, you can have that on or off as well. Okay. And then that's it. And now, if you wanted to program each one of these, mm -hmm. you would do just like most machines. Hold this on. Okay. And it's going to go into its. There's the grinder. See, program. It does seem a little bit more quiet than than the previous version. Just a titch, well, I would say. Well, if it is, it's because my hearing aid isn't turned up. Well, I don't have a hearing aid, Gail, and it seems a little bit more quiet to me. Neither do I. <laughs> <laughs> but Maybe that's because you don't have your hearing aid in, Grammy. It's because my hearing isn't as good as it used to be, and I'm thinking it's a lot quieter than it used to be. So then... So now yeah. that's how we do our program for that, but I'm my dosage I'm doing each time using that. Is that true? Yes. Okay. That's true. So um, you would take it up to I'll show you. Because I'm like, you just did extra mild taste scale, and that is no way to start the morning. It's got a lot of settings. Mm-hmm. So you can do that for extra each mild. each time each and then this yep. is your Let's take it up to Extra strong. Extra strong. So I made a we lot of ounce there. Looks pretty good. Yeah. So and then the same with the milk. When you put the this when this is in here, this is going to dispense hot water. Okay. And when this is not in here, and you put this in, you're going to get your milk drinks. And you can program the amount of milk for the cappuccino, latte, and the macchiato as well. Okay. By hold, this, you do it the same way. You just hold it. Got it. Okay. And it does the same. And yep. then as soon as you stop. Um, okay. Then, then it knows which one of these to pick as well for your coffee. Can you give me a little tour of the other things? Like where are my beans at? Where's my water? Beans. I know. Mm. Right here. <laughs> Up top. Up top right here. Okay. And this is your grinder setting right here. For fineness and coarseness. Yep. And then the okay. dosage obviously is done over here with this button. Mm -hmm. Uh, Pre-ground with your scoop right here. Nice. Deluxe. Ooh, a little different shape. <laughs> cup warmer over here. And the cup warmer, uh, I didn't read about it, but I, I can almost 100% say that this is an active cup warmer because I put the machine on yesterday to kind of play around with it, and mm -hmm. immediately it got hot. Nice. Stainless steel casing, which is kind of nice. Your water tank, like all the glowing, right here in the front and pretty big. Yeah. 
And then your uh, brew group is it in a yep. front axis? It's right here. Ah, oh, okay. They call it the infuser. And there's mm. your drags box. We've been playing with it this morning. Mm -hmm. And this is a stainless steel drip tray. It's nice. It's very nice. Yeah, that's one thing they do really nice is the casing and all. Oh, uh, you, take yeah, it you can't take yeah. it out because it's, the piston is down. You can that's one cool thing with the DeLonghi's is you can't remove it when the machine is on, so you can't get it in a mid-cycle story. It <laughs> Some of the other ones you can. You can take it out in, uh, yeah, and yeah, mid-cycle, it's like, and it's like you gotta jerry rig the machine a little bit. Exactly. Yeah. So it's but no, a little bit, a little bit of a fail-safe. If I was to shut this off, this would all come back. The piston would go back up, and and this would, actually this would come down, and you pull it out. Pull it out. Okay. And you want to um, clean that. Once a week with hot water. Yeah. Spray it down. Yep. Give it a squirt. Okay. Do you want to make a want? milk drink? Sure. All right. We'll pause. We'll get ready. Yeah. We'll dump this. Okay. So yeah. Kat wanted a cappuccino. I do. Okay. So first thing what I would suggest that you do out there is by pushing the clean cycle, mm -hmm. you can actually warm up the cup. And all of the, the system. The system yes. here. Yeah, it's really more for the system than it is the cup. <laughs> um, but that means if you're somebody that likes really hot milk and usually one touches might not work for you, yep. it's gonna it's gonna exactly. get it's gonna get you the best as, like, as the hot hottest as it, as it can go. And really, that did warm the cup, even though it, you didn't think it was going to. <laughs> it did. Okay. okay. So now we're gonna push cappuccino, and on the new lid they have three different options: one, two, and three. Cappuccino is number one, latte macchiato is number two, and then cafe latte is number three. The programming in the actual software in here still gives you only the one and two choices like it did on the previous model machine. Okay, so it's prompting you not in the correct manner, so right. you and should choose it do, from the Do it yourself. Lid. Yeah, do it okay. from the lid for what you want because this is where the, mo the quality of foam is controlled. Okay. It's just that this isn't doesn't have number three on it, but you I can see. still use it. So I see. We're gonna do a um, cappuccino. What do you, you want a cappuccino? Yeah. Okay. So we're gonna put it to cappuccino, and you're gonna see that it's going to prompt us. I think to, to number two or three. Yeah, three. one of the two. It's not not three. Not lined up correctly. Yeah. Uh, number two. Yeah. Yeah. So actually, cappuccino is number one on here, but the software just needs to be updated. I would say. You want to check that temp. Don't get on the face here. <laughs> That's enough milk. 159, it was at. That's nice. That's good Let's for see. just milk with foam. Let's see. Yeah. Not bad. And then it's going to give us our drink or our coffee in there. Can we see it? see it. The bottom is in the way, Gail. I wanted the separation. Oh. The pretty. Mm -hmm. But we can see a little bit now coming up the top. Okay, you can stop now. <laughs> What's oh, our yeah. temp at? Ouch. Oh, That's hot. where it's at. Yeah. That's, meow. It was at 165. Okay. That's pretty 166, hot. 166, 167 is rising. Okay. 170. I'm going to give a little taste to Rue. Yeah, why don't you just keep playing with this? <laughs> <laughs> oh, the separation is behind the bottom thing, but yeah, you can see it. Yeah. But it's hot. It was hot on my finger. Hmm. Oh, that's plenty hot. Plus you preheated the glass too, so. We did. Not a lot, but a little bit. That's hot. Mm. Mm-hmm. Woohoo. Huh? Yeah, it is. <laughs> that's something to always think about. Preheat everything with these one touches. Absolutely. Um, cool. All right. So, so if you just wanted to make a sh uh, a shot, yeah. Let me show you that too. What the heck? Let's make a double shot. Extra strong. See, it, it will stay wherever you last had it. Okay. Your dosage. Yep. It's grinding a lot. It grinds more. Mm -hmm. That's what that's all about. And then if you want to do bypass, you just run this up from extra strong right up to bypass, and it's one scoop. Oh, okay. These spouts go up and down, too. I'll show you when I'm done. 
Look at that. That looks nice. Uh huh. ask it to stop because we didn't really program this. It's probably at the default. Amount of water. Well, a few of us have played with it, so who knows where it's at, right? Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. So, see, <laughs> you can go to bypass doser. Pre-ground. That's what it's called. And then you could choose your drink. Now it wants you to clean because you did some milk drinks without cleaning yep. it. So you just press that for basically as long as you want. Yep, and usually you put a cup under there. Yeah, just shoot some steam out. So you can see that the clear water is coming out of there now. I know in the beginning it was that little bit of milk. So basically, I mean, it was a little bit more quiet of a grinder. Um, mm -hmm. And then I would say really the only sort of like meow is the weirdness with the software. Yep. But, you know, it's not like it's. It's fu not functional. You just have to be no, aware of that. Just look you at know. it and choose what you want up here. Yeah. So if I wanted water, I put that spout back in. Check this out. Hot water. <laughs> well, it had to release a bunch of steam first, right? And then yep. it. Okay. Yep. Cool. All right. So that is the sixty-six twenty Grandama yes. by Delonghi. I made a mess. Yeah, you did, Do you. I have to clean it mm -hmm. up? Why do I always have to clean up? Because you're so good at it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you make a good mama. <laughs> you're so good at it. Yeah. All right. All Thanks, right. Gail. You're welcome. Have a good day.